everyone, I'm Waga Warrior, aka Julie. Welcome to my channel. If you're new, Wago stands for when you get old. All right, a couple of weeks ago, I posted on my community tab that Tarte was having their semi-annual custom kit sale. The custom kit, in my opinion, is the best deal. If you are after like the newest releases, probably not. However, they do have some cult classics and a good selection. If you like the products I'm sharing or just the good value, I'm pretty certain they do it twice a year. I was looking back at past videos of mine. In 2023, I had a fall custom kit video and then in 2021, I believe, it was in the spring. So I'm fairly certain they do this twice a year. Your order will come in a beautiful lilac tissue paper. Um, yes, so it has a lot of padding. As I pull each product, which by the way, I don't remember what I picked because I placed my order on May the 15th. It didn't ship until May the 24th and then it arrived on May the 29th. So yes, it's been two whole weeks, which doesn't sound like a lot of time. But for me, yeah, my memory, not so good. So as I pull each product, I will share on screen what all of my choices were. So the first item is a complexion product. This here is the Shape Tape Cloud Coverage. I have it in the shade 16N, which is a fair light neutral. This product also has 15 SPF, which isn't a lot, but I will take any additional SPF when it is in a product. All right, I think I selected a shade that may be a little too dark, but we'll just call this my summer shade. This is a squeezy tube with a pump, which is my favorite type of packaging for just about anything. All right, maybe it will work out. It's thick, similar in consistency to like a BB cream. Ooh, maybe that would be a perfect shade for me. I'm gonna list on screen all of the different choices. There were quite a few. In general, the choices for each category range anywhere from six to like 13. In my opinion, the benefits of this sale are if you are interested in products from Tarte, and some of them have a MSRP of like $35, $40. With the seven for $69, you get six makeup products. The seventh product is actually a makeup bag. So each makeup product is only $10 and the makeup bag is nine. So for a $35 or $40 product, getting it for $10, it's a fantastic deal. All right, this next product is from the cheek category. This here is the Tarte Sculpt Tape, which is like a contour bronzer stick. And I got mine in the shade Light Cool Bronze. You follow me, thank you. Uh, you are well aware that I love contour bronzers especially these lazy girl style packaging. This is very similar to one that Charlotte Tilbury has, that e.l.f. duped. It's basically a trend where you squeeze up the product. I hope this one, yes, this has a lock. So you unlock, lock, squeeze up, and it comes into the sponge, and then you just tap, tap, tap. Here's everything that was available to select from in the cheek category. The cheek category will include bronzers, blush, highlighters, and basically anything else you can throw on your cheeks. All right, the next category is what they call prep. It's kind of the catch-all where if it doesn't fall into lips, cheeks, or eyes. I ended up picking this brush here, which is the Park Avenue Princess Cream Face Brush. It's dual sided. Well, that's nice. So this end is kind of shaped as if you're going to do contour, bronzer, or even blush. And this one is more kind of oval and a slightly more dense than this size. I love using these types of brushes mainly for the density. And yes, it never hurts to have a dual ended brush. Other products that might show up in this category are skincare or other tools. All right, next item. Um, I'm confused. Here's the bag, which I'll share in a second after I rant. I was wondering why my box felt really light. 
I am missing the product I selected under the eye category, which for me was a, I think it was a nine pan eyeshadow palette and the mascara category, a mascara. Let me take a look at my cheat notes and see what else. Okay, so I got the cheek complexion, missing eyes, oh, lips. So they, they missed out on half my box. What the hell, Tart? All right, um, obviously as soon as I'm done filming, I'm gonna need to get on the computer, write a complaint. Not only did it take forever to arrive, but then half my stuff is missing. Let me share with you the bag. I'm also annoyed that I'm doing this video without wearing any makeup because I plan to film the get ready with me after I did the unboxing. And then once my makeup was on, I can film another video. Oh my goodness, Tart. I'm pimping you out for free, not on any PR list or anything, not that I need to be, but I'm just saying, here's a free video, pimping out your sale and you screw me over. All right, so here is the makeup bag I selected. Unfortunately, I forgot to take screenshots of the options. I wanna say there were only two other bags. One was black and one was maybe metallic. Um, this is a decent size. I like how once you kind of flatten it out, it, it has a flat bottom, so it will rest nicely on your countertop. Um, it's a beautiful, nice pink. Um, yeah, so this video is going to be a lot shorter than I originally planned on. Let me know if you also picked up the Tarte, what do they call it? custom kit, and we're half your products missing as well. Oh, stuff happens. Um, yeah, so just from the standpoint of as I was filming a video, it sucks. If I was just buying this, I'd be a little, oh, that's annoying, and write an email, but because I had so many plans for my videos today, it makes it a little, a little annoying. So apologies for the little rant there, but hey, you get to see real time what's going on as I film. All right, well, I don't even know if I'm gonna post this or if once they send me everything else, then I'll redo this. Okay, so it is now five days later. I originally filmed the unboxing on Saturday, June the 1st. Today is Wednesday, June the 5th. Tart may have screwed up my order but let me just say their customer service is top notch. So after I got done filming, I sent an email explaining, hey, I'm missing three of my products. I listed the products that were missing. Not expecting to hear back until like Monday. I actually got an email back Sunday morning where they apologized and they said, we will rectify the situation. And it also included like a shipping code. I'm like, what? The very next day, over a weekend, they shipped out my replacement products. So like, what? <laughs> Who does that? Well, apparently Tarte does that. And considering how slow the original box was to arrive, this arrived really quickly. So let's dive into this little mini box and hope that they actually sent me the products I originally selected. After I told them what was missing, part of me, the evil side of me was like, I'm not gonna use that tubing mascara. I should have said I was missing product X that I didn't get, but I thought, no, that's a little shady. But I bet I could have, because they literally didn't ask any questions. It was just like, hey, this didn't arrive. And they said, okay, we'll ship it out. So very, very, very good customer service in my opinion. All right, so we have a little mini box from them. It, the products are also, packaged nicely in some tissue paper and let's cross our fingers they sent me what i was supposed to get all right i am seeing three products which seem to be what i was missing all right so the first product is what i just mentioned the tarte tubing mascara um i only wear waterproof if and when i were to wear a non-waterproof it would probably be a tubing mascara I have tried this before once and it did not disappoint. I didn't notice any tubing when I took it off, but it didn't flake or make me look like a raccoon. Um, I was very careful though. So 
Yay, I have another one. Um, I think I'm just going to put this aside for my big 2K giveaway. The next product is the Maracuja Juicy Lip, and this is in the shade Guava. Of course, I'm already wearing a very pink lipsticky gloss. Actually, it's the one from uh, NYX that is kind of a dupe for this where you click it up. But let's see if the shade... No, that, that, the NYX one that I'm wearing is a little more pink. This seems to be more... Um, yeah, it's kind of clear, which I'm fine with. doesn't have a very strong scent. And oh, I forgot. Don't overclick like I just did because you can't click down. Oh, I clicked up really high. I hope that doesn't get goopy in the cap. All right, the last product is, of course, the one I was most excited about and the one I was most bummed wasn't in my box. That here is the Tarte Positive Vibes Eyeshadow Palette. When you are getting a $69 box where you get to pick everything, the mere fact that you get an eyeshadow palette, that you get to select your color shade, that's really, really nice. Okay, so most of you are probably going to be bored. But this is right up my neutral alley. Okay, yes. We have some pinky, peachy kind of shades and then some nice kind of warm toned browns. Uh, I am really excited that this finally arrived. So aside from the little shipping hiccup, I think the Tarte Custom Kit is such a fantastic deal. I got six makeup products all of which I was able to select myself, plus a makeup bag. And we aren't talking like, oh, go pick from the eyeliners that aren't selling and maybe like a lip liner. No, I got to select a foundation, a makeup brush, and I wanna say this retails for like $35. One of their newer products, which is this contour stick, a makeup bag, a mascara, a lip product, and an eyeshadow palette. So each makeup product slash tool ends up being around $10 and the makeup bag is $9 off of the normal MSRP. That's how they get to the $69 price point. That's fantastic. But let me know if you've ever done this custom kit or if after seeing this, you're like, sign me up next time. So I'm dying to hear from you what your thoughts were about the products I picked and let me know if you picked it up as well. And if so, what did you get? All right, I wanna thank each and every one of you for stopping by. I really do appreciate it. If you haven't done so by now, I would love if you would subscribe. For those who have, thank you so much. Remember to click that bell icon so you can be notified of future videos. And if you can do me a big favor, clicking on the thumbs up, it really does help with my channel to grow. All right, thanks everyone.